Okay, in this video I'm going to show you a possible solution if you're having problems logging into your Netgear router. This particular router here is the D7000 which I bought um, roughly a month ago or so. And I found at first I was having problems um, logging into the interface. So I think you go to routerlogin.net or .com and sometimes it would work and then it would freeze and other times you couldn't log in at all and you know it was all kinds of problems. What I found was the problem was, was the actual USB stick that I inserted into the um, side of the router. So, so this was obviously formatted on my PC and already came, contained some files. When I first inserted it, it worked perfectly fine. And then all of a sudden I couldn't get into the interface and change any settings. And I'm thinking the, the, the damn thing's faulty. And, you know, so eventually, you know, I kind of figured out what was causing this problem. So I, I unplugged my USB stick and, and you know behold the whole thing kind of worked again I could log into the the interface and change all the settings perfectly fine so what I found is I, could, I took the USB stick out and then I reformatted it now I'm not sure what kind of format you, you should, you're supposed to use as there's no kind of instructions in the box but I formatted it to FAT32 using my Windows PC you can also use um, some third party programs so if you are finding a problem where you can log into your Netgear router through um, routerlogin.net or the IP address of your router. Make sure if you have got a USB stick or a USB hard drive plugged into your router, take it out, try it. If it works, then you know that the USB stick or the USB hard drive is the problem. And just try formatting to FAT32. You will use, lose your data and you will have to re-upload it again, but it may be a problem that this only works when it's formatted to, to um, FAT32. So if you are having that problem, just try that and it might work. So thanks for watching.